Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you haven't already, I hope you will subscribe. I post free and cheap grocery hauls as well as other budget-friendly videos in between, such as budget-friendly recipes as well as these are simply breakfast ideas in this video that I've put together for free and very, very cheap. As well, there is a second video. I apologize if you hear my baby in the background. <laughs> um, but it, there is a second video that you can check out as well, and it's my vegetarian chili served five ways. Again, very, very budget friendly. So my first example of a very free and cheap breakfast is this yogurt with clementines and um, cereal sprinkled on top. It's very delicious, it's kind of like a parfait, but the yogurt is extremely inexpensive. I'll show you how in a second. The vector cereal I stocked up on when I was able to get it for free, combining some sales and um, coupons right from the Kellogg's website. Here's the yogurt deal. This comes up all the time. I wait to price match it at a very cheap price and apply a coupon. This one was printable right from the Danone website. And as well, the clementines were under $3 at Costco for a five pound crate. This next deal here was free for some people and very cheap for me, depending on what coupons you had available. Uh, I stocked up on some oats during, again, waited for a good sale and applied Quaker coupons you can get from tastyrewards.ca. They come on and off there. And the, the strawberries and blueberries, I am a member of the Driscoll panel, consumer panel, I'll leave a link below. But once you do so many surveys, you can get up to a dollar, it goes from uh, 50 cents, 75, up to a dollar coupons for your fresh Driscoll berries, and then check out 51 and other apps like that often reward cash back for produce. The Weetabix cereal, if you watch my grocery hauls, then you know I had a ridiculous amount of these. <laughs> I donated some during the holidays as well as I've given them to family members, but I personally enjoy the cereal. Now I top it with frozen berries, and this here is an example of how I got them for free. There were coupons on both GoCoupons and Save.ca, high-valued coupons for the cereal, and then I used it at a time I was able to get a cashback reward from my, one of my favorite apps. I'll leave all the different links below. Now, the berries, they often have coupons as well, and I think currently there's even a rebate for frozen berries on Checkout 51. This breakfast here, it had the Bolthouse Farms um, juice. These are quite expensive, so I do look for ones that are marked down with an upcoming expiry because a bottle that little doesn't last long around here anyway. The breakfast itself was an English muffin topped with cream cheese and strawberries. Now the English muffins, I get those at Costco because they come in a four pack for $3.99 and it beats any dollar no-name brand that I can get anyway. Even Walmart's great value is now up to I think $1.25. So the strawberries, that's a price matching one and again applying rebates when I can. And it's topped with some chia seeds, but that is a Costco go-to. Nobody beats their giant bag of chia seeds. As well, the cream cheese, often if you are um, a member of the Kraft website, subscribe and get emails from them, you'll always be notified of new coupons. So of course I price matched and applied and stocked up on some cream cheese. Now, if you haven't already, be sure to watch the second video in this kind of two-part <laughs> one that I'm posting here. This is vegetarian chili served five ways. Of course, the chili is budget friendly, but it's extremely tasty and healthy. So check that out as well. And let me know if you like these kind of videos or what else you'd prefer to see. Leave a comment below. And again, please share my channel with anyone who would enjoy. Thanks for watching.